I'm still wearing my PJs, but I wanted some watermelon. <laughs> I drink a little bit of water. I drink some water with apple cider vinegar, but there's a doctor. And forgive me, I can never remember his name. It's an older guy uh, with dreadlocks. He's very uh, slim. And he doesn't drink water. He gets his water from fruits like watermelon. So... I have this watermelon, and they say you, the ones with the light part, like on one side, and you're supposed to bump it. I, I don't know, but I'm hoping I picked out a good one. <laughs> and it has seeds. Yes. I'm so excited. But yeah, he's an older guy with long dreadlocks, and they are all gray and he climbs trees and everything he's very fit and I'm not sure what his age is but he eats very healthy he only eats from nature and I want to be like him when I grow up So let's see here. Mm. It's definitely sweet. <laughs> So I definitely picked a good one. Mm. I think I'm gonna eat this whole thing right now. <laughs> So, I hope this was helpful. Although it was very short. But yeah, uh, from what I understand, you're supposed to pick a watermelon that has that light part on the bottom. And it is sweet, so maybe that is a good theory. I'm not quite sure what the thumping is, but I do it all the time. Because <laughs> that's what somebody told me. A long time ago, how to pick out a watermelon. So I hope this helps you pick out a sweet one if you like watermelon. And of course, I like my watermelon to have seeds. Um, and not be Jeanette GMO. So, there you have it. Again, I hope this video was helpful. And as always, I love y'all. Later. Mwah.